I recognize the 
continue to cooperate and assist the United Nations, the European Union, and other international organizations and local leaders in support of the further development of the safe and secure and peaceful Kosovo. As for my team, we have come together from all over the United States and have built a strong, cohesive organization. As commander of Multinational Battle Group East, I look forward to building a strong relationship with all of our multinational partners. Together, we are a more mobile and deployable battle group. We are able to respond on a moment's notice, anytime, anywhere. Again, it's an honor for me to lead multinational battle group East as we also represent the best of the international community. We come from many areas of the world and from many different cultures with the shared goal of maintaining a safe and secure environment with freedom of movement. In closing, the people of Kosovo have made such great progress and have demonstrated increased capabilities over the last several years. There is more work to be done, and we will preserve these accomplishments as we work together to build and sustain an atmosphere of shared respect, understanding, and diversity. The future of Kosovo and its children deserve nothing less than peace and prosperity. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, Major General, Air Guard, Distinguished guests, Excellencies, Ambassadors, Generals, of the United States Army, of the Kosovo Security Force, of K4, colleagues of uh, the Kosovo Police and ULEX and the international organizations, mayors, ladies and gentlemen, dear fellow soldiers. It's my pleasure to join you here today as we conduct the multinational battle group East Change of Command. This is a time honored military ceremony that symbolizes the changing of the guard. The mantle of responsibility and authority will pass from the current battle group commander, Colonel Francisco Neumann, to the incoming commander, Colonel Michael Schwartz. My, comrade, today, my comrades, today is a very special day for both of the commanders and their contingents. For Colonel Neumann and the outgoing K-413, some members are still there. This day marks the end of a very successful tour here in Kosovo. And for Colonel Schwarz and the incoming contingent standing here in the parade formation, K414, today marks the beginning of a new opportunity successfully established and maintained a safe and secure environment for the international community, the Kosovo security forces, and the Kosovo police. This allows us to operate with a reduced force structure without compromising the success that has been achieved by these organizations. It is this achievement you and your previous comrades celebrate. Kosovo has never been as stable as it is today. This is why NATO has initialized the phase in which we have begun a controlled restructuring of our troops. That being said, we continue to hand over responsibility. You have been the commander of this contingent and multinational battle group East during the last eight months and thus decisively contributed to an overall accomplishment of our K4 mission. One of your main achievements was the reorganization of the multinational battle group East into the new structure. We have led you have led our, your soldiers and you, they followed you, showing true leadership. You have been a reliable partner to our superiors and I really thank you for your high level of professionalism, dedication and sincere commitment to K-Force mandate of a safe and secure environment. Paco, we will miss you as a highly respected and reliable commander.
Ronaldo. I wish you a safe and speedy return home to your family. Again, thank you very much for a brilliant job. Take care. At the same time, I know that uh, in the future, multinational Battle Group East will be in Valut by saying, no commander can fulfill his duties done and will do for multinational Battle Group East, for K4, and most importantly, for the people in Kosovo. And I'm this is a